this is Johnny Stewart. How are you? Uh, I'm good, Johnny Stewart. How are you? Uh, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I was calling about your listing on Crown Point. Uh-huh. It's been listed for a while. What's going on? Nothing. <laughs> really, I mean, we get about a showing every week. That's about it. Why? Really? Really? Why hasn't it moved yet? Uh, we just hadn't gotten an offer. I hear that. I hear that. Yeah, I was taking a look at it, and uh, what what my business does is we buy in cash. Oh, I'm not interested. Or, I, I, look, what, what that's you, my builder. That's my builder okay. who flipped the house, and okay. I, I'm not gonna put any more money into it than I already have. So, <laughs> I don't want you I to. Put, I don't time, want you to put any money into it. Going on right now. Excuse me. I don't want you to put any money into it. What are you talking okay, about? Okay, so you need to be quick because I got a lot going on. Today. <laughs> oh wow! Y'all are y'all are wearing us out soliciting stuff. So well, I'm not I'm not trying to sell you anything. What are you talking okay. about? Are okay. people trying to come in and sell you stuff? What, what, what happened? If you just get to the point real quick, I mean, really, I do have a lot going on right now. A lot. Okay, so when is a when's a good time for me to call you back when when you when you have some free time? Um, you know, it, I don't know why are you calling me. Well, because I'm interested in this property that you have listed. You want to see the property? I want to buy the property. You want to buy the property? I want to buy it. And okay. and I took a look well, at let's it. Make and, a deal then. Oh my. <laughs> I can do that. I, look, you have no idea how many calls as agents <laughs> we get for people trying to solicit our business, to build us a new website, to yeah. uh, advertise in this, to do this. Yeah. I've been representing this builder for about 15 years, okay. ever since I got into real estate. Okay. And he bought this house from a, uh, a dentist wife. It was a divorce situation. And he totally went in and renovated this home. I mean, from new shutters to new windows to new gutters, new flooring. I mean, pretty much most everything he's redone. Yeah, it looks it, brand I mean, new. So, I mean, it's, yeah, it's a big house. And, you know, $700,000 houses here in West Tennessee don't move overnight. But, Absolutely. you know, it's steady having showings and it's, I mean, it's a, it's a nice house. He just yeah. put a new HVAC in upstairs. It's got a huge upstairs. Um, okay. you know, it's just, uh, yeah. it's either too big for some people or, you know, um, it's just a lot of house. And, yeah, uh, I can tell. It's just been, it's, things have been slow around here. I mean, heck, anything under 250 or under even 300 is flying yeah but yeah. anything over 500 is like yeah. you know i mean yeah. you're getting showings but oh we're just looking did people he, waiting to see if interest rates go down or yeah what kind of loan did he take did he take out a hard money loan on this one or did he just do it with his own cash uh well he did a construction loan ah construction loan okay yeah okay yeah. Yeah, so so I know you said you got a lot to do, so I don't want to waste any your, any more of your time. There's yes. not a lot of equity in this, so I saw this as an opportunity to do something a little creative. But since he has a loan like that, I just don't want to touch it. So I appreciate your time, and I wish you the best. Okay, thank you. All right, you have a good one. Bye bye. Damn, she wasn't very nice. One for more options. Glenda, this is Johnny Stewart. The auction's tomorrow. Are you just going to let the property go or, or what's your plan? I'd love to help you out if I can. Give me a call back, 774-219-3450. Again, this is Johnny, 774-219-3450. Thank you. Hello. Hey, Tara, this is Johnny Stewart. How are you? Good, good. I was calling about that property on Hollywood Drive. Is that one still listed? It is. Okay. What, what's going on with it? It's been a couple. Good, been a couple of days. It's been on market. Well, uh, we've had to have any good offers. I hear that. <laughs> I hear that. I hear that. When do, when does this listing expire? Um, they've extended it. Why? What's up? Okay. Awesome. I, I was just wondering. So, so what, what my company does is we buy cash or we try to get a little creative if cash doesn't work. It looks like they haven't owned this house long. Is that correct? Um, I think they bought it in 21. 
Okay, okay. Is there is there a lot of equity in this one? Well, probably not, because I can't get what I'm asking for it, right? Yeah, that's that's what I was thinking. Okay. Well, well, would your sellers entertain if I come in and I pay your commission in full? I give them a couple of grand, and I'm, then I just take over that mortgage. Really? Is they're there... trying to recoup what they put into it and all of that. Um, yeah, yeah. They're trying to buy where they are. They moved out of state. So, I mean, we just need a legit offer. Now, if you want to give me a legit offer, cash, yeah. obviously they'll consist it. But they're not going to do anything, you know, like yeah. what you're talking about. Yeah. I mean, how much, how much cash do they want? Yeah, but I'm saying like after that mortgage gets paid and you get paid, they pay you. How much cash are they walking away with? Um, I mean, I, I, I'm not exactly sure. I mean, they they are pretty firm on the price right now that we have it at. Yeah. They've come down already twenty thousand dollars. Yeah. Um. So as of right now, they're pretty firm on that price. Okay. Yeah. The reason why I'm asking because I, I just want to know how much they would walk away with. And see if I can match that or even exceed that. I know it's been listed for a long time, so I'm sure they're probably ready to get rid of it. So if I were to be able to come in with the number in their pocket that they want, it might, you know, sway them a little bit. I mean, if I was able to yeah. pay them $20,000, pay your commission, take care of closing costs and fees, would that be something that was is even worth pitching to them? But I mean, basically you're saying they're not going to get their payoff. It's still, they're still going to have a mortgage, right? Like you're trying to... Well, yeah, right? the, like, yeah the, mortgage, the mortgage will stay intact, but I mean... That's what I mean. They're trying to buy another property when this yeah. fails. They need yeah. this to actually sell. Well, I mean, I've done situations like this where I can definitely get them approved for another mortgage. We would just have to restructure the way we well, do let it. Let me say this. Let me say this. Yeah. Look, yeah. If you want to send an offer in writing <laughs> and spell out whatever you want to do, I will submit it to them. Like, as in just send them the email? Because, I mean, I feel like if I take the time to write out the terms and you just to submit it, they're probably not going to understand. I would love to get on the phone with both of you and explain kind of what's going on. If, I know it's been, they want a new house, obviously. It's been on market for 200 plus days. We could structure a lease option to where I'm able to take over this property, give them their 20 grand, pay you, and they're able to get a new loan and move forward. Mm -hmm. I, just, I just don't want to you know waste any of our time by typing up something that um, your sellers may not well, understand. Look, just said, put it in an email to me and spell out exactly what you're proposing. If they have any interest in it, we'll put it. it we'll get on a phone call. Okay, perfect, perfect. What, what was your name again? My name's Tara. Tara. My email is Tara at ConnorRealEstateLLC.com. Hold on, Tara. You said that too fast for me. Hold on, hold on. Okay. Tara. <laughs> T A R. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I'm not ready yet. Okay. T A R A at at Connor Real Estate LLC Connor Real Estate LLC dot com. Okay, Tara at Connor Real Estate LLC dot com. That's it. Okay, awesome. I'll, just kind of give me like a synopsis of it and I'll yeah, talk to them and for if there's sure. any for sure. I will send you an email here shortly. Okay, perfect. All right, Tara, thank you. Thank you so much. Bye. Right, Thanks. Bye. Hey, Margaret. This is Johnny Stewart. How are you? This is who? My name is Johnny Stewart. We talked uh, about a week ago on that property in Jackson. I know you said you, that you were in the middle of, you know, getting it saved. I just want to see where you guys are at on that. Um, well, we're thinking of the plan. 
Okay. Have you guys done a loan modification yet? That's what we're working on. Ah, okay, okay. Have you just are you still doing the paperwork or do you just wait already have it submitted waiting on them to to get back to you? Yeah, we're we're just working on uh, paperwork right now. Okay, awesome, awesome. Yeah, the, the loan mod is the number one way to save the house. So you guys get that paperwork in, and I wish you the best. I'll be in touch in about a week just to see where you're at. Appreciate it. All right, Margaret, I wish you the best. Thanks. All right, bye-bye. Wow, she answered the phone. Took me off guard, man. I did not expect her to answer the phone. We'll call her on the first. Give her a week. Hey, Sydney, how are you today? I'm good, how are you? I'm good. My name is Johnny Stewart. I was calling about one of his listings on Emerald Breeze. Okay. Yeah, can, is there a way that I can get in touch with him directly? Uh, yes, uh, his cell phone number is 343-2900, area code 731. 731-343, and what were the last digits? 2900. All right, perfect. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. All right. Bye. Hey, Lee, this is Johnny Stewart calling about that property on Emerald Breeze. If you could, give me a call back, 774-219-3450. Again, this is Johnny, 774-219-3450. Thank you. My man, this is Johnny Stewart again. How are you? Good, good, good. Good. You guys have every property in Jackson, Tennessee, huh? Not all of them. <laughs> it seems like what are you it. looking for, Johnny? Hey, I'm looking for Ann Short. Okay. Did you get a hold of Lee? I did not, but I got his cell phone number, and I gave him a call and left him a voicemail. Okay. Um, uh, you'd like to speak with Ann? Yep. All right. Let me see where she's at. I'll see if I can't get you transferred. You're good. I appreciate Do you have access to their cell phone number or you can just transfer me to their desk? Let me see. Let me see. Which property are you calling on? The one on 28 Crown Point Cove. 28 Crown Point. Yeah, that's a end. All right. Yeah, here's her cell number. Um, 731-225. Eight one four three. Seven three one two two five eight one four three. Great. Perfect. Thank you so much, my man. I appreciate it. All right. Okay. It's in the plans. Yeah, I just sold the one next door for the same price, and I pre-sold another one in there uh, three weeks ago for the same price. So it, it's just the time of year that we started is primarily the problem. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Are you, do you think you're going to just take it down and relist, or you think you're just going to leave it up? No, we're not going to relist it. We're just going to sell it. Yeah. Did you have a, a builder come in? Was this a new build? It is a brand new house, yes. That's ah, brand new. okay, okay. Perfect, perfect. Well, they just take out a construction loan? Who, who, who built it? Who's the builder on this one? Johnny Freeman. He's from here in the Jackson area. Ah, He's been building for over yeah, 40 years. Yep, I know who that is. Yep, I know who that is. Okay. okay, awesome. Well, look, I don't want to waste your time, man. I did not see that this was a new construction. It just came across my desk, so I wanted to give you a call. But uh, I wish you the absolute best, my man. Okay. All well, right. you wish. I'm sorry. I didn't understand what you said. Yeah, I, I was saying, this one came across my desk, and I wasn't aware that it was a new build. So, I don't okay. want to waste your time. I, I don't, I'm not into buying new buildings. But if you oh, okay. yeah, but if you run across anything that just needs a little bit of love, or if it was recently purchased and somebody's trying to sell with without any equity, I'd be happy to take a look at it. Okay, so where are you from? Are you here in Jackson or somewhere? I'm in Nashville, Tennessee. My partner's in Memphis, so I'm I'm pretty close. Okay. Yeah. Right, so what is it you're looking for now? I'm looking for any and everything, right? So if a property just needs some love, if it needs to be fixed up, I'm your guy. Or if a 
seller hasn't owned it very long and they don't have any equity and might have to cut a check to sell their house, I'd be happy to take a look at it and make sure that they don't do that. Okay. Uh, well, that sounds good, and I appreciate your call. Awesome. Is this your cell phone? This is my cell phone. Okay. I'm going to text you my name and a little bit about me. If you could, just save, save my name and your phone as Johnny with the Money Bags. And anything that you have come across your table, shoot it over to me. I'd love to take a look at it. Okay. Well, thank you for calling. All right, Lee. I appreciate it. Uh-huh. Bye-bye. Uh -huh. Hey, you said you had it locked up at two fifteen. Yeah. Uh, this dude offered two twenty, but he didn't want to pay closing costs, and he didn't want to pay his agent that's representing him. <laughs> <laughs> um, she asked if you got any price reductions lately. Why the fuck you need it? Why, why did you need an agent? I I I'm, I don't know. I'm just referring. I'm just telling you what Cat said. Cat said. Yeah. The person who handles the uh, the uh, investor list. Yeah. Um, but you said what about? She asked if there's been a price reduction. No. Thank you. I think you said number. I mean, it's at a pretty decent number. I mean, it's listed on uh, it's listed on investor list pretty high, but where I have it is pretty good. I mean, if somebody can come in at two twenty. Uh, uh, you know, that's, that's a good deal. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But yeah. 2000 So that's, you know, that's pretty good over here in Georgia. That's pretty close to 1%. In Georgia, you don't go find 1% unless you're going down to, like, naked or some bullshit. You know? <laughs> but that's 1% in this metro Atlanta. That's pretty good. So, I mean, yeah, I mean, let's just see what rolls in because, uh, yeah, we can't pay it. We can't pay it. We can't pay them three percent to my agent. Oh no, there's not even money to be made in that. I uh, I just sent her a text. I'll keep you updated. Uh -huh. All right.